McVitie's factory closure confirmed. You may have seen a video I did a few months ago about the possible closure of the historic McVitie's factory in Glasgow. At the time, this was only the consultation period and the company was considering its options, but now it's officially come out and said that no viable alternatives have been put forward by unions or by the Scottish Government, meaning the factory will close. In my opinion, this consultation period was just a farce anyway, like they are in many companies. But the fact is, they don't want to be in a country where there's such instability at the moment through a completely ineffective government and also in a country that wants to isolate itself from the rest of the UK. No doubt the rest of the UK for McVitie's would be one of its biggest markets, surely. Its official reason for closing is that they're overstaffed nationally. But the factory and the brand are profitable. The truth is, they're moving over the other side of the border, aren't they? The announcement only came out from the company when the SNP decided to launch their campaign for India Ref 2. And the plan to move the factory was due to take place, well, will take place, when Sturgeon said she'd launch the next campaign. It's no coincidence. The fact is, and it makes perfect sense, they don't want their business to be caught up in the SNP's suicide mission. They see it's far safer to move on the other side of the border where their business distribution will not be interrupted. Don't forget as well, this is going to cost roughly 400 jobs plus many more in the distribution chains for people like delivery drivers. And apparently the company aren't even moving far. They're only going just over the border to Carlisle. That tells you all you need to know. Where are these people going to find new jobs? Tourism is on its arse. High streets are on their arses. Scottish hospitality is completely knackered at the moment. Where are they going to find new jobs? Well done SMP and well done Cranky. Operation Destroy Scotland is in full force.